Oh, hi guys! Welcome to my YouTube channel called Abby's Corner. Mm -hmm. So today, hmm, I'm talking about. It's a very, very, very funny topic. When a friend of mine asked me this question, I was like, "This requires a lot of thinking because." Um, I really can't there's no direct answer to this question it's just based on what i feel and what i've heard people say and you know right now it's a question for that the guys are asking you know the voice of the guys out there so the question is or the topic is why do good girls like bad guys yeah why do good girls like good girls like bad guys sorry so when I had this when the person asked me this question I was like okay I have to just attack the question in a very objective way so the question is we need to find out what is the definition of a good girl and the definition of a bad guy w would you say a good what would what, what would you classify as a good girl like if do you say the good girls are you know there's not really there's no exact definition to the word good and the word bad i just feel good is opposite of bad so there is no exact definition to it so when you say why do good girls like bad guys i would rather want want to rephrase it this way why do girls like guys that are mysterious? Yeah, that's what I would say. Because when this friend of mine asked that question, I was like, I will not say someone is bad. The fact that someone, a guy is adventurous, and the fact that the lady is adventurous, doesn't mean that that person is bad. You know, we have no right to judge someone by... You know, we have, no, we have right, no right to judge someone. It's just like saying, you, you can't define it. You, you, you don't have a right to define what is good and what is bad. But we could say, okay, we know what sin is. Sin is like the opposite of righteousness, yes? So, to answer that question, I think for girls, for ladies, I don't know if whether good or whether bad, I don't know, but we don't want to use the, 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 I don't want to use those, I don't want to use those choice of words. But what I think for ladies, they like it when a guy is mysterious. They like it when their life is full of adventures, you know. And the fact that a guy broke your heart doesn't mean he's a bad person. The fact that the girl broke, broke the guy's heart doesn't mean the girl is bad as well. It's just life and maybe they found they were not compatible. And that is why they parted ways so if I, always, I always believe that if two people are not together they don't get married eventually it's because they were not meant to be doesn't mean the person is bad but we know that we, that when you talk about like bad i, I associate it with something like vices like killing stealing you know um committing certain crimes i that's what i define as bad but i would not say someone is bad because someone broke a girl's heart so for for, for guys out there that are asking this question, why do good girls like bad guys? The question should be, why do good girls like um, guys that, they can't, that are not just straightforward? I don't know what I'm saying right now. I hope I'm saying something right. But for, but for, but for me, my own opinion, I would say um, good girls or good girls like it when a guy is not just you know straightforward no 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 no, no i'm not saying not, not so straightforward you know not like when a guy is boring they like it when you know you're just full of surprises like it's not the regular um you call me i call you and life does you know goes on like that it's just you know there's no no i i i, I watched i watched a movie yesterday and the person was like the guy was breaking up with the girl because it was you know and he told the girl his reason was that she was just too simple she she I'm, I'm trying to get the exact words the guy used it was so annoying like um there is no drama in the relationship you know like guys <sighs> guys it's good for you to summer winter in your relationship when i say summer winter i mean like you go through the thick and thin of a relationship but like i don't i don't think someone should have this crazy crazy drama 
So of course, some guys will say you don't want this girl because the girl is boring or they feel the girl doesn't have. You know, it's it, it's just a personality, and it doesn't make the person any less. You know, it doesn't make the person any less. It's just a person's personality. And for me, I like when a guy has a good sense of humor. You know, the, the guy is not someone that you can easily predict. I'm not talking about when you want to break, you want to break someone's heart, too. but someone that you cannot predict that. You know, there are different sides to the coin. Like, you know, there's this mystery. There's this, you know... I remember one time talking to a particular person. He was saying, I can't date a puppet. Like, I'll say, girl, sit down here. She sits down there. No. No. He wants, he wants a girl that could, you know, that can stand up for herself. A girl that can, you know, go extra mile for herself. A girl that, that is not about... She wants to be a slave to a man. I think that is vice versa as well. A guy, a, a lady would want a man. And, but I've heard, but although I've heard some statements that actually actually scary. They would say they like when a man is in control. Good, is he, he can be the head of, of his home. He can be a man because he's a man. But it doesn't mean that he has to be all uptight or all, um, you know, mean or without emotions and all of that. No. That is not what that's not that's not the definition of a man. So when it comes to saying a, 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 a lady looking for a guy that is bad. No, it's not for a guy for she's not she's not getting for a guy that is bad. Rather she wants a guy that there's no dull moments with there's no there's no crime in being a nerd as a guy. There's no crime in being, you know, a bookworm as a guy. It's the same thing. There's no, there's no crime in being, you know, just, you know, the introvert kind of person. No, it's all about your personalities. How both of you can actually kind of handle your excesses. How you guys are compatible with each other. Yes, I don't know if I answer, I've answered that question. Uh, the thing is... There is no good girl, there's no bad guy, there's no bad girl, except you're committing a crime. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But when it comes to relationships, when it comes to adventures, I think every human being, irrespective of, the, of your gender, every human being loves adventure. You know, it's not like saying you are with someone or maybe you eventually get married to someone and then it's just the same thing, the same way you lived your life when you were dating. Like, them, it's, it should not be that same way. There should be, there should be this spice in the relationship. So that's why I feel some ladies don't want to get married to a guy. They feel, they feel the guy is boring. He's always reading. Maybe he's always studying, studying, studying. He's always on his laptop, always on his computer, always busy, 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 busy. And that's why yeah, of of situations or stories where, um, situations or stories where or, or scenarios where, a lady would say a guy doesn't have time for her, blah, blah, blah. A guy is this, is too busy with work. It's because a lady wants attention. And maybe these players of, of a guy, of, of these, these players I would call guys, so those guys are players. They know how to play. They know, they know what a lady wants. I guess that is what, hey, that should be the word. Like, why do girls fall in the hands of, of players, of, you know, Casanovas? It's because... These so Casanovas know how to play their cards well. You know, some people say you, you, girls like listening to lies. Girls like when a guy, a, 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 girls like when a guy like and lies to them. And it's not because of that. It's just because there's this mystery. There's this, there's this feeling. You know, there's this sensation you get when a guy, you know, sweeps off your feet. When a guy is just there to just fill your day or your week with surprises. You know, it's not about the gifts. It's just about that 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 diversity that variety in that one package i don't even know what i mean like <laughs> so i guess that is that that is what or, or, or that is the mystery behind the whole situation so guys who have asked this question it is not that girls like bad guys or girls like falling in the hands of players but it's just that these guys know how to play their cards well and then it's, and it's, it's not a crime for you to be a good guy so to speak or for you to be a guy that you know that you know is all serious and focused it's not a crime for you to be that focused and be social and full of spice you know you should be everything you know everything you like i i, I always say it's that for for ladies that want to get married that will say oh no i, I think I don't, don't be too uptight and say okay you want to just be on your own you want to just be this good 
um, this, 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 you know, dutiful wife and all of that. You should go out. You should go out of your way to, to you know, to imp to to impress your husband. The same way, vice versa. You should go out of way to impress you. You know, don't just do things the same way over and over. You get bored, and that, I think that's the reason why most people cheat on each other in marriages or even in relationships because they they don't they don't they've not understood themselves to you know know what what you know impresses the other person to to, to touch that that person's soft spots so yeah i guess that that is just it so i hope i don't mind my face you know i'm, I'm tired i'm about a busy day i'm about to go to bed you know i just actually does this short video and i hope you enjoyed it anyway so guys thanks for watching thanks for watching and do subscribe if you have not subscribed subscribe on abby's corner hit on the bell the blue bell so you get notifications each time i upload a new video like share comment criticize guys i got you i got you you know sending your questions sending your topics sending 